Hey everyone, welcome to my channel ASP.NET Core and this is the second video tutorial of uh, Smallvi tutorial and in this video tutorial first of all I would like to say uh, the new page concept. Uh, in the last video tutorial I have already discussed about the tabbed pages and uh, content pages. So in this video tutorial I am going to show you uh, how to use uh, flyout pages. So looking like that flyout I mean to say that when uh, hamburger menu click uh, and that uh, when we click on the hamburger menu then we'll show a, a simple master page uh, in the left panel and show in the right side we have a new pages like that okay like the detail pages so add a new page new item and fly out page demo just set a uh, movie.net movie page and that is the fly out page demo okay and in this video uh, we have a fly out page demo okay in the fly out page okay and in the cs file we have fly out page fly out page fly out page okay so the I just I want to set that the first page is the flyout page. So uh, flyout page demo. So here we have a flyout page demo. Okay. Uh, so in the next we have flyout page demo and uh, okay. Set uh, just open the flyout page first of all. And you can see here we have a stack layout. Just I want to set uh, first of all uh, master and detail section. So here we have a demo that flyout page dot flyout uh, that it means it's it is a master page so flyout page dot flyout a content page like title is a master page and in the content page we have a label control okay and the detail page is also uh, we have a flyout page dot detail section in in which also we have a content page with the title detail page and the label detail page details okay so now the save this and run it in windows machine and just run it okay so this is the uh, fly out page demo here we have a master page and the uh, content page and the default behavior is default just i want to set the behavior that is the default just wait for the some times and you can see the flyout page demo so uh, that section is related to the master page detail and that is the detail page uh, details so here we have two sections and if you want to set uh, like the backgrounds Is screen and is red okay and just I want to uh, run this window on your uh, Android emulator okay so just click on the pixel 5 API 30 play button and uh, will run on your Android uh, device okay so here you can see that uh, th that is the red color that is a detail page and when you uh, slide this uh, slide this page like that that is the master page okay when we click in the red area then uh, master page will hide okay so this is the master page uh, and the detail page section okay so this is the flyout page and you can set also the behavior flyout behavior and here we have uh, some options like pop over split split on the landscape split on portrait so split uh, it's a uh, you can see in the windows machine and pop over you can see in the um, uh, Pixel 5 mobile device, so just set the default. 
okay so uh, the next lesson will go for the next page that is the flex layout so sorry flex layout is actually a layout but uh, uh, in this video tutorial I am going to discuss about the pages so the next one is the navigation page so uh, in the navigation page we will discuss about letter because in details uh, and uh, just consider about the uh, in the detail sections okay so here we have a man page just I want to set a uh, uh, navigation uh, at here okay so uh, here we have a click event so just set first and second page new item and dot net movie and here we have a first page and the next one is the second page add a new item and the second one is the second page so just set app in the app.xml file first of all new that is the new navigation page so here we have navigation page and uh, here you can just set the first page in the navigation stack that is the first page okay so in the navy uh, just when we use navigation page then it means it create a stack for the navigation uh, for the um, navigation for navigating pages like the first page is the first item in the stack and when we click on uh, uh, and go for the second uh, then push the navigation uh, just push the uh, pages into the stack in the first position that is the diff zero position and uh, first page just when we click on the button control here we have a button and text is go to second page and click handler okay so just save this view code file and just click navigation dot push async new second page okay so go for the second page actually so just you can see the output in the windows machine also just run fast in the navigation stack so uh, when we click on the uh, button then uh, pages will move to the stacks in the first position and back button is also there and also a title bar with the back button okay so wait for some times and uh, you i will uh, you will see the outputs so here you can see the first page just when we click on to the second page so the back button is clear so the second page in the navigation stack so uh, here we have a navigation with the two methods that is the push async and the second one is the pop async okay so uh, that navigation is actually discussed in the latter videos so this video tutorial is here and thank you very much for watching this video and please don't forget please subscribe my channel also